My brothers and sisters, Moses, Musa alayhi salam, was sent to Fir'aun, the Pharaoh. To put you in the picture, the worst of mankind at the time was the one whom the best of mankind at the time was sent to. Allah already knew the Pharaoh is not going to accept anything. Allah knew that he's not going to accept the message, he's going to reject it, he's going to die on kufr or disbelief, right? Did Allah not know that? Allah knew it. So why would Allah Almighty want a messenger to have an entire mission that he would mention in the Quran that would come down to all the other prophets of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala about something where there was a man who wasn't going to accept the message and how Allah sent this man in order to show you and I the importance, the greatness of so many things. One of them being the way you talk to someone, the way you make them feel. Don't give them the excuse. Look, if I see bad and I stand on the mimbar and I start talking about individuals, insulting them, belittling them, one day they will come right. When they do come right by the will of Allah, what will happen? I will have a sin for everything I said. I pay the heaviest price for whatever I said, the insulting. Allah refused and denied Musa alayhi salam to insult the Pharaoh. But we are insulting people better than the Pharaoh and we are nowhere near Musa alayhi salam.